It's all been in our culture. It has never been in our supporters' culture. It has never been in our culture to chop and change coaches, even in a season or two seasons or three seasons. We've always given the coaches a chance and opportunity to implement the vision and the plan. And uh, I don't know where the culture comes from now for our supporters trying to you know, Zabalaza at the stadium. I think it's a, it's, a, it's a new culture that we don't understand, but it requires patience, it requires understanding and managing. Even those supporters, understanding their questions and their passion and, and their emotions, what they're going through. The game has changed today. There's betting, there's all these people are emotional. The economy is bad. They depend on certain things. They come to the stadium with hope, to find hope, to enjoy and find hope to go home happy when they get disappointed those emotions starts of what has been happening in the week and whatever so the culture has changed remember our sports industry is to give hope and joy to our supporters and that's all they just want the three points they don't care one nil they are happy but it's unfortunately it puts pressure on the very players it puts pressure on everybody it's how we're going to manage it and go forward with it. it takes our leadership and our character to manage the process for the incident of Malifi leaving and Arthur we had workshops, even the FIFA breaks, we have workshops with the executive, with discussing even with the board. Chief's culture, the chief's way. We, we're trying to grind this thing out to say, what, what, is, what is it that... In that space, we lose two games. We lose a league and we lose a cup. Supporters are fighting. Now we must... The, now the vision changes again to say, that interim structure or that structure that we wanted to say, let's build for the season, continue because we just acquired players with the same technical staff and everything. In that space, what as a board, as in terms of executives, and even from a technical plan point of view, to say these are our challenges, we can see they are forthcoming and everything. This happens now. A decision has to be taken because people's lives are at risk. Security must be at risk. You understand what I'm saying? So it becomes a challenging factor for us as management. But we are saying it's part of our job to manage and understand the challenges. It's a big brand. It's a big organization. It's not an overnight decision making. You know, a session where you say tomorrow we don't want this coach because no, you lost two games, three games. No, no, no. It's not that way. To build it.